Welcome back to Lasco Ford. Today we're going to take a look at the 2020 Ford Escape Hybrid. Not just any Escape Hybrid, this particular one has the SE Sport Package and it's all-wheel drive. Let's get right into it and talk about the powertrain on the vehicle. This hybrid vehicle is paired along with Ford's new 2.5 liter Atkinson four-cylinder engine. Uh, the gasoline engine is an uh, unconventional five-stroke that's actually been designed to specifically operate at peak efficiency at all times. And the gasoline engine is only part of the hybrid powertrain that includes an electronic controlled uh, CVT transmission. To talk about performance specs really quick, that engine has 163 horsepower, 155 pound-feet of torque, and it's actually 200 horsepower total uh, when taken in the hybrid system in consideration. Uh, those powertrain features of the hybrid are a 1.1 kilowatt lithium ion battery. Uh, it has a uh, electronic traction motor, uh, electronic controlled continuous variable transmission as we mentioned. It does have regenerative braking. It does have uh, deacceleration fuel shutoff, intelligent oil life monitor, smart charging alternator, uh, twin independent uh, camshaft timing. Something really cool to point out about that hybrid battery is that it's 60% smaller than the battery pack in the 2005 Escape Hybrid. Uh, it's actually liquid cooled. The battery sits on a chill plate um, and it has an electric water pump that flows coolant to a dedicated radiator at the front of the Escape. Um, the air conditioning, refrigerant cools lines uh, that the battery coolant flows through and there's a water-cooled battery uh, actually has advantages over a fan-cooled battery because of no noise and heat from the battery does not end up in the passenger compartment. So some pretty cool fun facts there uh, as far as that battery on this, this new uh, generation of Hybrid Escape. So you can see uh, the Sport package comes with blacked out wheels, you got blacked out mirror caps, you even have a blacked out antenna fin, all kinds of nice black contrast on this uh, vehicle here. The specific color on this is a Sedona orange metallic. And while we're on the window sticker, uh, let's look at the fuel economy. You have 40 miles per gallon combined, 43 in the city, 37 on the highway. Obviously an optimal vehicle for your city driver because that city stop and go driving is going to take advantage of uh, you know, the hybrid technology and give you maximum fuel economy. Before we go to the inside of the vehicle, uh, let's just take a little walk around and talk about some of the new features uh, that the Escape has. Um, offered on the new Escape is a heads-up display. Uh, you can get the EcoBoost version, which is a 1.5 liter i3 engine with cylinder deactivation technology to help increase uh, your miles per gallon. And then you have an eight speed automatic transmission on the EcoBoost. Uh, you have the option of a B&O sound system. You have evasive steering assist technology, Ford Copilot 360 technology, uh, LED headlamps, uh, post-collision braking, pre-collision assist with automatic emergency braking, rotary gear shift dial, selectable drive mode, selectable shift capability features, uh, with a sliding 60-40 split bench in the second row seat and the Seek 3 that we've been showing you on some other models. So all kinds of available options on the 2020 Escape. Uh, let's take a quick look at these headlights. New LED headlights have a fantastic design. Got your blacked out grille. Obviously, once again, some awesome contrast on the Sedona colored Escape. And we'll just get you a good profile view here. We've had a lot of people very impressed with the profile of this vehicle. Uh, I think that when they first saw it in pictures, doesn't quite always look the same. And now we have them driving on roads, pulling around the lot, and people have just been uh, very impressed with the lines of the car. Obviously have your embossed escape across the back. You've got your rear view camera, dual exhaust on a hybrid. Thought that was pretty cool. You've got your hybrid badge right over here. Signifies all wheel drive. While we're back here, let's just go ahead and take a look in the back. Got a little surprise for you back here. Uh, obviously, all kinds of floor mats. Uh, this vehicle is headed up to Traverse City, Michigan. It obviously has the all-weather mats right here, standard mats right there, 
uh, great for Traverse City and all the snow they get. But check this out. So you'd think there'd be a spare tire under here, right? But it's actually the battery, the standard battery to the vehicle. So the hybrid battery is located underneath on the passenger side uh, of the vehicle and it's non-intrusive so it doesn't take up any cargo room and then they relocated this battery back here and we'll pop the hood before we go inside too um, and there's no spare tire so you're going to save on weight and then they have an inflation system for you obviously you're going to you know buy the vehicle and it's going to come with roadside assistance so uh you know I, most people aren't going to want to change their tire on the side of the road anyway so you're going to be calling for roadside and uh and get your, your your tire changed that way so let's take a look under the hood really quick new double pull system so you don't have a, a hood latch anymore i'm going to pull this once then i'm going to pull it twice that's actually that second pull is the latch and so when i come to the front of the vehicle now I actually can lift right up. So there's that new engine. You can see orange cabling, obviously all hybrid related. You're not gonna see that on a standard escape. Give you a good look there. Go ahead and close that down. Let's go ahead and get inside the vehicle. You can see as uh, this sticker indicates, this is a, a retail order for a customer. This is actually being delivered here in the next day or so. Pretty cool design on the door. Give you a good look at the interior. It's actually, uh, if you can see, that actually sticks up a little bit and has a texture to it. So it's not, uh, it's not just a pattern, it's actually a texture. Rotary dial, all new for this, uh, this redesign. Very cool, we had a, a great, uh, great feedback from customers on that. You've got your nice digital display we'll go ahead and turn this into accessory mode really quick looks like transport mode is still uh still active that's all right check out this all new digital display it's actually on the calm screen right now so you can actually uh, eliminate a bunch of display features and make a very simple uh, display that's not distractive you know while you're driving and that's all customizable very very cool you have uh, some fan, vehicle still dirty, just dropped just off the truck, but you've got uh, some really cool interior features. We'll give you a good look at the back of the vehicle. All kinds of room in the back. And you notice how much cargo space there was when we were looking in the back of the vehicle. I'll give you a good look down here. This is also another uh, very impressive, the center console. This is like a, uh, some type of composite that they've put. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. They've put this really cool design on. I mean, looks super high end, a really you know, luxury look. And you gotta remember, this is an SE Sport. This isn't a titanium. We're not in the, the, you know, the highest trim level. We'll take a look at that window sticker again. I think you'll be surprised what the price is. You can see the leather stitch center console. You can see the drive modes we talked about. Let's see if we can get those to go off in accessory mode. There you go. So there's normal mode. Let's see if I can get this to adjust without blowing out Let's see if we can do that so there's normal mode we'll hit it twice again eco mode sport mode and your hybrid check that out slippery mode great for traverse city where it's going deep snow and sand it's going to be your full all wheel and then back to normal so you know that's a that's a first for this escape hybrid is to have uh, driving modes Obviously, uh, selectable steering wheel, all kinds of uh, voice activated controls, both sides, cruise control, volume controls. And why don't we, uh, let's take a look at that window sticker. All right, so we have an incredible amount of glare coming in in our drive uh, or delivery lane right now. So try to look at this window sticker with you really quick. Um, you can see up top there, that's what we were talking about, 2020 Ford Escape, SE Sport all wheel drive, wheelbase 106.7. Uh, it's got the 2.5 Atkinson we talked about. It's got the ECVT transmission we talked about. Sedona orange metallic, dark earth gray cloth seats. But let's take a look real quick and then we'll go back up. Let's look at the MSRP before we start talking about this. 30,900, okay? Now, that, that's after a special discount package for the all wheel drive. That's a, uh, a regional discount package. But 30900 
And let's just talk about what this vehicle is going to come with. You obviously saw everything we walked around really quick, but you know, look at all your exterior options that are standard. You know, LED lighting like we talked about. You know, all those uh, you know simple standard options that are nice conveniences. Um, you got one touchdown driver window, dual illuminated vanity mirrors, heated front seats, 10-way power. Um, you've got illuminated entry system. Uh, instrument panel, that 12.3 inch digital panel that we pointed out. I mean, that's all brand new full digital screen, um, customizable, um, leather wrapped steering wheel, rotary shift dial, uh, smart charging USB ports, um, the split seats we talked about, telescopic, uh, you know, moving uh, steering wheel. Um, lots of standard items there, uh, like AM, FM, MP3, six, you know, six speaker uh, sound system, your Copilot 360, Ford Pass Connect with hotspot, Intelligent access with push button start. I didn't show you that on the door. Um, you just you know tap right up on the black black panel and uh, enter your, your key code and get in. Um, pedestrian alert uh, sounder, rear camera that we pointed out in the back, secure mode, keyless entry keypad, Sirius XM, Sync 3, uh, advanced track. Uh, obviously all your safety equipment with airbags and everything. Um, fantastic warranty. I mean, you got five years, 60 roadside on top of the three-year, 36 bumper to bumper, and then they're going to include that eight-year, 100,000-mile hybrid unique component warranty, which, you know, you're buying a hybrid, it has more technology, and they're going to include a, a special eight-year, 100,000-mile on those unique components. And then this group, this 201 package, uh, you know, comes with, uh, like I said, that discount package, and then you've got a cargo shade, floor liners, the 17 inch wheels. I mean, this thing is packed full of technology and standard features, and it's coming in at 30,900. I mean, it's an incredible value. Let's take a look real quick. We were talking about that entry keypad. I can show you that since we're already on the outside of the vehicle. So you can literally lock your keys in the car, or I, whether it's intentional or on accident. Um, or if you even don't have your key and you need in really quick, you come up, you touch right here, you punch in your code, you can actually lock the vehicle, um, you can unlock the vehicle, um, easy access. So it's a fantastic feature that Ford actually, I believe, has patented uh, that our customers just love. So taking one you know, exterior quick look at this 2020 Escape Hybrid one more time, give us a call here at Lasco Ford. It's 810-629-2255. We'd love to hear your comments and questions in the comments below, uh, so please do so. We try to answer everything we can. Uh, we obviously ship to all 50 states. Uh, we've been shipping vehicles all across the country, helping our customers get the best value, best pricing, uh, the vehicles that they want, and obviously the best service. So you know, give us a call. And then before we jump off here, please like, please subscribe. We're trying to grow our channel. We appreciate the support. And let us know what next video you want to see. We'll keep them coming. Thanks.